hey everyone so here i'm doing exercise 7.3 second question this is from class 6 and the chapter is fraction so the question here is write the fractions and pair up the equivalent fraction from each row okay so first we're going to do here is we're going to write the fraction for each of the figure so the first one is so there are two equal parts and only one part is shaded the fraction is 1 upon 2 or I'll let me write down here so this is 1 upon 2 next one we have uh, 6 equal parts out of that 4 are shaded so it's a 4 upon 6 the next we have a 9 equal parts on out of that 3 are shaded so the fraction is 3 upon 9 the next we have 8 equal parts out of that 2 are shaded the next one we have a 4 equal parts out of that 3 are shaded the next one so we have a next row here so here if you see there are 18 18 uh, triangles we can say out of that six are shaded and the next we have eight uh, rectangles which are equivalent uh, equal parts eight equal parts and out of that four are shaded the next we have 16 right yeah we have a 16 squares equal equal shape out of that how many are shaded uh, if I remove it's it's 12 12 are shades 12 upon 16 and the next one we have 12 again 12 uh, equal parts out of that how many are shaded we have to count it's 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 8 upon 12 and the next again we have our triangles here So here we have a 16 uh, triangles. Let me just recount this. This is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Yeah, 16. Out of that, 4 are shaded. Now, after this, to check if they are like equivalent or not, what I'm going to do, I'm going to bring all the fraction to the simplest form. That is, we have to cancel the numbers and then we have to bring it to the simplest form or the lowest form. So the first number, 1 upon 2, is the already simplest form. We don't have to cancel this. The next one, we have a 4 upon 6. Cancel it. In 2 table, 2 twos are 4 and then 2 threes are 6. So we'll get 2 upon 3. And the next, we have 3 upon 9. We can cancel this. 3 ones are and then 3 threes are. So this is equal to 1 upon 3. 2 upon 8 also we can cancel 2 ones and then 2 fours are we get 1 upon 4 3 upon 4 we cannot cancel okay so here 1 upon 2 and here we got 2 upon 3 1 upon 3 1 upon 4 and then here we got 3 upon 4 now for the second line we can cancel 6 and 18 this is 6 ones are and 6 threes are so 1 upon 3 is the answer 4 and 8 also we can cancel this in 4 table 4 ones and 4 twos are so answer is 1 upon 2 12 and 16 we can cancel this in 4 table 4 threes are 12 and then 4 4 16 so answer is 3 upon 4 we can cancel 8 and 12 in again 4 table 4 twos are 8 and then 4 threes are 12 so the answer is 2 upon 3 and the next we have 4 upon 16 so 4 ones and 4 fours are 16 thing but 1 upon 4 now we have reduced all the fraction to the lowest form or the simplest form. Now we start solving this. So the answer for the first one that is A. Okay, for the first row we have A. The answer will be equal to the fraction for the first figure we got is 1 upon 2. And here the second figure we got as, uh, in the second row the second figure is 1 upon 2. So A will match with the second one. Then we have a B. So in the B, we have a fraction 2 upon 3. And here, the fourth figure in the second row is actually 2 upon 3. So the answer for B will be the fourth one. The next, we have a C. For C, we have the fraction 1 upon 3. And 1 upon 3 is equal to the first one, first figure of the second row. So it is the oh, first one. Now the third one, not third, I'm sorry, the fourth one, D, we have 1 upon 4. And 1 upon 4 is, is same as the fifth figure in the second uh, second row. So the answer will be fifth figure for the D one. Last we have a E, the fraction is 3 upon 4. And 3 upon 4 we got for the third figure. So this will be third. Okay. So this is how you have to solve first, write the, all the fraction, reduce the lowest form and check which fractions are equal. So I hope it's clear. In case you have any question or doubt, you can drop a comment below. Thank you so much for watching.